recommend people, if you're picking up Zero Suit Samus, to try and work grabs into your game. Yeah, absolutely. All right, so we're going to have Zero versus Crispy, two players who are actually uh, attending a lot of events. Uh, Zero, part of the Living Like Larry crew, mm -hmm. and Crispy, part of V5. We're going to see these guys um, actually, I believe it's next Tuesday. Oh, yeah, at the crew, crew battle. battle. Yeah, at the, the crew battle rendezvous at, uh, at GameWorks. We're going to have, um, I believe it's actually going to be L3 versus V5 and TNF versus Swift. I believe that's what it is. Because L3, no, I'm sorry. It's going to be L3 versus TNF and V5 versus Swift. Did I say that? I think I said it wrong the uh. first time. I don't know. Who cares? But <laughs> uh, these guys may not be going head-to-head -head in the next crew battle, but we will see them both probably participating for each uh, respected crew. Yeah, probably. But right now they're here at the Arcadian trying to, trying to take home that prize money today of uh, part of the... P Tony, do you know what the uh, pod distribution is today? Okay. So, six, 60, 30, so the actual payout um, before the additional entries is 160, 30, and 10. So that extra Christmas money, you know, yeah. for anybody who wants to take it home today, pick up those last minute gifts from someone. Yeah, and I mean, hey, you might maybe buy a round for everybody at the bar if you're old enough. Yeah. 21 <laughs> or older. Don't drink and drive. We're going back. We're going right into Smash. Oh, oh that's not Smash. Okay. Crispy's breaking out the Pac Man. I don't know how I feel about this. He's been really digging Pac Man, but I really hate Pac Man. Why? Dude, look at him. He's just a little ball. So is Kirby. That's true. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so All right. I immediately regret everything I said. He threw an orange at Luma and put that star back in its place, back into the galaxies. All right. So this is going to be an interesting matchup. Let's see how he utilizes the key in a map. Oh, okay. Oh, That's my God. I'm <laughs> so mad. Okay. I'm back to hating Pac-Man after that. Like, are you kidding me? I was so I was so hyped to see that orange beat Luma, and then he throws a key and gets it chucked right back at him. And he eats the hit, too. Oh, my gosh. That's a one-hit fire hydrant smash. Was it? I, I saw him hit it a couple more times. He's trying to pick up the melon, but he can't. Up smash. Sends him into the air. Up air. Misses. If no I'm not mistaken, didn't Abadongo and uh, Debuzz play at Evo in this matchup, or was he only Wario? I'm not sure. I think he might have gone Pac-Man game one, lost, and gone Wario game two and three and one. Or, you know, three out of five, however that set would have gone, with Pac-Man switching into Wario. Crispy is really not able to play if his fruit. Zero just keeps taking it away from him. And you know, honestly, it's um, pretty close right now with only 20% difference this early of a game. Now, I would give Rosina a very heavy advantage, especially on this stage, because that up air is so vicious. But I, I, like this, uh, th I like this diagonal approach from Crispy coming in with uh, forward air to neutral air. Mm -hmm. It does link if you're able to hit the first one. Unfortunately, the smash from Luma hits, finishing off his first Oh, one. the water pushes him, connects two up air. Or I think it was an up air, right? After the jab? I think so. The jab, the third hit jab and up air look almost identical, I think. <gasps> oh! Did he get hit by his own? Yeah, because he uh, lost possession of it. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Good play from Zero. Great awareness. Hits him with a hydrant. Takes oh the my stop. God. Wow, that, that was didn't, quite that powerful. I didn't even see him in the bubble. Oh my goodness. All right. So Crispy, bring it right back. Only taking 32% of extra credit. Now, some extra credit, again, like we say, is better than no extra credit. Oh, oh my no. gosh. Okay, I thought I thought that hit. That was just wow. a hydrant. Wow. Good job from Zero. I think he threw out the reflector just in time. Or uh, the, uh, the warp. I don't really see... Crispy doing the usual anti-Rosalina tactics, which is, which is try to get Luma out of the field and then, you know, wreck on Rosalina. Right now, Luma's not even on the field, and he's just playing defensively. I, I think that's just the bread and butter of Pac-Man, is to zone, zone, zone. Oh my gosh, goodbye, which is, Fire Which Hydra. is unfortunate, because that was his chance to get some real damage in without... You know what I'd like to see is uh, when he throws out the Hydrant and he gets absorbed, I'd like to see him actually punish the uh, the animation, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Oh, lands into the down smash at 41%, but... Uh, it ends pretty quickly, though. Yeah. Uh oh, up smash. I think the next smasher up here is going to take uh, Crispy Socks. So Zero looking very pretty on the stage. Um, Pac Man is only put on. Uh oh, that key is deadly if he gets hit by it. Dash, Dash tech, attack. Jumps out of it without B. Wow. If Luma was there, he would have lost his stock. He would have died if Luma was there. All right. Where does that ready? apple go? Who cares, man? <laughs> we don't. Dude, an apple a day won't keep Rosalina away, so might as well get rid of it. Forward throw. Sends Luma out. Uh oh, up uh oh. Smash. Up tilt. Good awareness. Oh, oh my good. gosh, that down smash. Jeez. 
He is just throwing out all the kill moves right now. Oh, kill Lula. Kill Lula. Oh, and he throws the key right back at him. I don't like... See, that's what I don't like about this matchup is zoning characters just struggle if you rely on your zoning tool to kill. That's I, right. I... I, even like, I don't like Zam uh, Samus in this matchup either because of that where your plasma shot is such a critical part of the matchup to yeah, end Yeah, and there's stocks. like nothing you can do. Boom, right. you just get absorbed like no one's business. You know what I mean? So, you hate to see that sort of thing happen. And now here comes he's Crispy's other Luigi. character. You know, here's the thing. He didn't do a bad job with Pac-Man. I feel like the matchup though is a little foreign and it's hard for Pac-Man. Yeah. So, good switch. I respect it. Goes back to town and city though. <laughs> yeah. Definitely trying to kill up B or down B actually. And, uh, and this is a good stage because Luigi does have a lot of kill options that go off the top. So yeah. uh, we just need to see which of these mushroom characters is going to win this matchup and use the stage to the best advantage. What angle does up smash on the... Uh, oh, diagonal, but you can kill off the top of it. Okay. I really want to see him focus on Luma a little bit more, though. Yeah. Uh, that thing, that was one big thing that he, like... There you go. Oh, there you go. As you <laughs> say it, chucks that star right out of space. You know? Oh, air dodge is okay. not a good option. Uh oh, this is... that's See, this is why I don't like that stage. That platform right there sets you up into everything. Ooh. Neutral air into nothing. I like the awareness. Last time he air dodged, this time he dropped in there. Tries to go for a double jab into forward smash, but definitely not a high enough percentage or enough rage for that to actually work very well. He's trying to fight Luma mano y mano, but I don't really think that's a great He's idea. He's not hitting anybody. Yeah, and even if he trades, it's a trade in Zero's favor because Zero himself is not taking any percentage yeah. from trading. You need to really punish Luma safe. Ooh! Oh, that was close. No! Oh my goodness! I, 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 I would have upbeat. Yeah. I want to really see that option used more. Back air. Back air is such a great tool. Coming in on Rosalina Luma, uh, diagonal. Oh! oh was behind an answer with the short you can There's the wiggle. All right. Good the stuff wiggle. from uh, from Crispy taking the first stock. Only 66%. 76%. Ah, <laughs> uh, but you know what? Zero is actually like right on the cusp of not being allowed to enter the tournament for a reason. He is one of our better players in our scene, and you know he's using a strong character as a strong player. He's not someone who's phased by oh, uh, combos. Oh my gosh, that was very smart. Fun. I love what <laughs> Zero just did there. He knocked uh, Crispy into Rosie and Luma and continued to be active with Luma. Very good awareness. Um, Tries to go for a spike. I think at this point, Zero is probably just going to learn some stuff about the matchup and take it to game three because he's a player who's very good at adapting. Oh. No Luma. One killed. All right, Crispy's doing a good job of putting out some extra credit. Uh, oh, goes for a read. That's an interesting punish. I would have just up aired after the... Yeah, I absolutely agree with you. I think Zero was probably going for the hardest read. Oh, good job from... Uh, oh, oh, he used his, he uh, used his double his jump. jump and then went too low. See, I think Zero, he knew immediately that was gone. He's not going to dwell on it. He's a solid player, knows that he made a mistake, and he's going to adapt to the matchup. He saw some things that, you know, he needs to look out for. And he's going to be, I promise you, Zero's going to be, you know, he's smart enough, very experienced enough to know that, hey, he rolled behind me and got a great punish. I ain't going to let him roll behind me and get a good punish again. I'm so surprised that he let that up be, like... Yeah, just kind of happened. And you know what? That's the thing. We're both surprised it happened. I don't think he'll let it happen again. You know, he's a very yeah. smart player. Going to Battlefield this time, definitely going to be using the platforms on this stage to his advantage. Yeah, and Zero, you know, being one of the favorites of this tournament, it's just known for counterpicking great stages and really just... This is, like, this is what I like to see when he really starts to utilize Luma uh, just entirely, this whole matchup. If you watch, now oh. he's really just focusing on using Luma, getting quick damage, and just max range everything. And this is, throwing, away yeah, this is throwing Crispy really off right now because this is a totally different play style. Look at max range everything like a swordsman. Yeah. This is this stage is just I feel like it's too small, like uh, for, uh horizontally for Luigi. Yeah. Like oh. the only thing it can use these platforms are is to extend a combo maybe one or two hits. But Rosalina can use them to zone to to hold to the edge guard with and kill off the top of also. See, okay, he's, there goes. <laughs> he kills Luma, but now here's Zero taking advantage of the stage, just waiting for Luma, not taking any damage. See, this is what I mean. Zero's one of those players who knows that, hey, you beat me last game, cool. I'm going to adapt now, and I ain't going to let you do what you want to do, which is beat the beat up Rosalina, Rosalina without Luma. Mm -hmm. See, boom, and Luma's right back, only taking 25% so far this stock. I still I still don't agree with, with uh, Crispy fading backwards after... Only a couple of hits on Lumaless Rosalina. I feel yeah. like he should have kept going until Luma came back up. All right, but that's just me. And you know what? I think Crispy would be better off uh, doing maybe a down throw to up air strings because I feel like those will connect a little bit better than forward air right now. Mm -hmm. Maybe even give him better damage. Uh -oh. Even if it's not better damage, it would have given him a better position. Yes, you're absolutely right. Oh, oh see, Zero's taking advantage of like the roll situation. He's rolling out, and and uh, Crispy's rolling in. Oh my goodness, down throw to up air does not end the stock. 
I think the next one's going to finish, though. Good momentum stall. I like the tornado. It was a little risky, but you know what? Oh, I, okay, I, ver I, I agree. Like I, I like absolutely that. agree with the option. But Air Dot, Slot Dodge is a little too much. Gets caught up a forward smash. Yeah, and Zero, here he is with that adaption. Just not letting it phase him last game. You know, he knows that, hey, I got caught. I'm not going to get caught again. He's only at 56%. So look at that. He's just zoning out. Without Luma, he's zoning Crispy out. And he saw that immediately right there. Rolls to the ledge, get out. See, Zero being a smart player, adapting. Mm -hmm. Crispy now, it's his turn to adapt. How is he going to get in versus this Rosalina? Who is showing that, hey, I'm going to play a zoning game. If he can't even get in on a Rosalina who doesn't have Luma, then it's going to be... It, it just shows how much struggle he's going to have when Luma is actually out. Yeah, because he's about to get eclipsed in percent right now. Uh-oh. Oh. <laughs> I don't think he meant to do that. Definitely didn't expect being um, clashed. Now look, see, look at the spacing. Zero's like, if you're gonna roll in, I'm gonna be max. I'm gonna be right in range to hit you. <laughs> Good down smash. down smash. Goes for a forward smash. Another forward smash gets punished that time. Crispy's really in a hole right now. Zero's doing a great job of just max ranging everything. Notice that Crispy has always gotten on the stage by neutral getting up. Yeah. Hey, every time he's rolled, he's taking like 30%. Yeah. Oh, there he's was not using any, of his, any other option either, other than jump er, neutral get up and then roll. Yeah. It's one thing to notice. Is he forward throw? Interestingly enough, he didn't use Luma to grab break. I don't think he might. Have, I don't think he had time. I guess. I'm sorry. Sending Luma out. Oh my gosh! Is he one frame? This will kill. Okay. Well. Nice interception. Well, well played by uh, Crispy. I don't like it, but well played. <laughs> you show oh, that star. What's what? Oh, it's coming up behind him. <laughs> <gasps> oh, well, well played by Zero. That he waited and then just punished him for it. That was so smart. Oh, my gosh. Crispy, please. This is so dangerous for you. Don't Just don't challenge it. I mean, that works. Okay. All right. Luma's, well, gone. Luma's dead. But he has a 112%. Down air. Uh, it's Yo, let's go, Crispy! At six, I think. Trying to use down B to stuff his... Oh! Comes back. He acts in time this time. He's not at the ledge. I'm pretty sure oh, if he gets a back goodness. throw at the edge at this point, he'll take off his dog. Yeah. And Ooh, that's the down air from Luma. One framed. See, Zero, again, is just another one of those players who knows how to execute a stock. Very similar to Dan. Yeah. You know, and I expect to see both of those players possibly in winner's finals just because of their experience, their commitment to you know actually playing the game and mm -hmm. playing it properly, knowing that, hey, just because I'm down doesn't mean I'm out. Yeah, you sure. know, the if, if you want to take a, a little bit of a difference, take a note from when Steelsburg played TK and he was down. He could never really get back into the game. Because he was trying a little bit too hard, too predictably, to try and get damage and yeah. close the stock out. And then you'll get someone like Zero, you know, who drops game two after a character switch and mm -hmm. just comes right back and two stocks crispy, you know. Just yeah. very well played from Zero and showing that, you know, that experience and that ability to be patient. I utilized your tools to the max, you know. And it's not even that he played perfect. He did make a couple errant mistakes, you know. He did space, mm -hmm. he did misspace a couple things. Yeah. But he came out with a solid two sock and was able to end Crispy Sock with a move that he probably didn't see coming with a downer. So mm -hmm. kudos to Zero and good good job from Crispy for actually uh, you know, bringing it back to a game three after what looked to be a very rough matchup game one yeah, with Pac-Man and Rosalina.